Hello everyone, this is the Volatile Frog, and I'm playing some Seven Days to Die. This is actually a German server I'm on currently, and they're actually being really friendly. Um, if you're interested, they're called survivalhive.de. Just some advertising there. <laughs> but yes, I live with a couple of people. Well, I don't actually. But I live near a couple of people. Um, yep. They built this massive wall around our bases, so... Uh, it looks like they're building something new over here, but I would like to show you my house, first of all. Yep. Um, I have a mine. Like, sorry, deep mine at that. Uh, I've got like a little moat around my house to stop the zombies, or well, we used to stop the zombies before they built the massive wall. But, yeah. I've got this lake here to refill my uh, water and stuff. And I have this cotton farm to farm the cottons. This cotton is very useful for making linen or cloth. It's pretty well defended. Uh, this is Alpha Point Nine, I believe. It's the one with the uh, frames that you can upgrade. So I've got all the frames upgraded around my house. Um, basically, the bottom of the house is protected from uh, zombies and such from killing me, which is quite you as far. I also have my doors lock locked and stuff as well. I have on my chest um pretty basic stuff really, um, my uh, food chest, my medicine chest, my plant chest, my whatever the hell that is chest and random stuff. I also have all this forge stuff as well so I can make ingots and things. Upstairs, um, I built this all by hand by the way, um, upstairs I have my gun case, uh, safe, with all my guns in it. I currently have a sniper rifle, I also have a pocket rifle, because you can't go wrong with either one of those. Um, I've also got these claim blocks to make sure people don't break my things, and I made a bed. Yep, they're actually quite hard to craft, but I made one anyway. And I've got this awesome, like, uh, escape hatch on the top, so I can, um, stand on the roof and shoot people. Ooh, a zombie. Oh, can I get him? Can I get him? Oh. Come on, come out. Damn it. I think he's gonna kill it. Yeah. Ah, sad face. <laughs> oh, is that another one? Goodbye! Hell yeah. <laughs> Just looking at me. It's like, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? Why are you shooting my zombies? Oh shit, voice crack there, Jesus. Um, but yes, I will show you some things, I guess. The mine isn't very interesting. It's just a, basically a tunnel goes all the way down and doesn't branch off or anything. <laughs> um, quite a lot of people on at the moment. This house looks interesting. Uh, I haven't actually seen it. It's, it looks like a bar, actually. Um, not too sure. Interesting place. Um, this is the new guy, I guess. Huh, pretty cool house. I like it. Let me tell him. Uh, where are you? Nice house you have. Kinda looks like a bar. That was me uh, doing voice chat, if you were the one dunning. So what's his name? He's not here. Oh, the fuck? Ah, Jesus. Whatever. It's a pretty nice house, so... I'm kinda jealous. Mine's only like a little two-room house with some walls on it. I might have to expand it, I don't know. Um, yeah. My neighbor, who has a massive corn farm, and my other neighbor, who lives. If I can see the entrance, I don't I can't see the entrance at the moment. He lives on the ground, basically, and he has this massive labyrinth of a house. I would go down there and show you, but every time I go down there, I get lost. But I might show it in a later episode. Um, yeah. This is what I've done so far, and I'll probably be back when I have something cool to show. I don't really want to keep moving around a lot. Um, 
if you can see the chat, he's saying, oh, by the way, don't ask because that's the guy's name, and it's not actually an insult, which is what I thought when I first joined the server. It's like, oh, dumbass. It's like, um, calm down. It's, it's um, not supposed to be made to people. God. But it turns out to be the guy's name. They've actually been really friendly. Um, Flocka, which is one of the mods on the server, he came and gave me some ammo and uh, food quite early on. So, yeah. I will be back when I have something cool to show. Seems like um, they haven't made an entrance to this uh, massive wall yet, so I decided to make a ladder instead. Um, I was actually going to dig under it, but I decided that was a bad idea. Just waiting for the uh, sticks to uh, craft from the planks. Um, takes quite a while. I'm glad they improved this crafting system. The start of the alpha um, it was horrible. It really was. You had to uh, find like, first of all you had all the recipes, and then you had to find the recipe. Oh god, it was a nightmare. I'm so glad they improved it. Um, yeah, and point nine has changed a lot of the game. I was actually playing a point, like, one or something. Is there a point one alpha? Hopefully hackers and then people who want to do harm don't find this ladder and jump in, but... I don't know. Is that someone over there? I'm sure I saw someone. No, I guess it, it was someone, but it wasn't a zombie, is moving too quickly. I actually planned to go hunting, that's why I wanted to go over the wall. <laughs> have I made that? Yes, I have. Good. We now have a ladder. It's a face. I guess they're busy digging a moat. <laughs> That's what I thought. Right. Hunting time, I think. Let's see if I can find some deer. Ooh, is that a... Yeah, it is. That's a, a supply drop. Yeah. The uh, planes go overhead and throw out shit from. Yeah, you know what supply drop is, why am I explaining it? But yeah, they uh, randomly uh, appear in the now and land. Um, the plane, I think, comes every minute to drop them. Which is quite cool. I'm actually uh, running low on food. I only have chicken rations, I think I have. Yeah, chicken rations. I have five of them, so it's not exactly uh, low, but <laughs> it's still kind of low. I need to food this up bird nest. This empty bird nest, that's useful. Um, I want to find some venison. Mm. I will be back when I have found a deer. No luck finding any uh, deer at the moment, but I did find a zombie. Hello. <laughs> oh, I got to love the sniper, really do. What have you got on you? Uh, some flaw. Hmm. I suppose that could have been useful if I didn't have a vigiline. Um, uh, blah, blah, blah. If I didn't have. Oh, what the hell am I trying to say? If I didn't have a heap of cotton on my face, then it probably would be helpful. Still no luck finding any deer. I don't know what's going on with the spawn rate with them, but. I don't know. I found some bird nests. So I've got some eggs. Still trying to find some deer. Uh, it's starting to get late. It's almost um, eight o'clock in game, so I have to be careful. Don't really want to get hoarded to death. That happens quite a lot. <laughs> well, if the spawn rate was higher, it'd probably happen even more. But yeah, whatever. Ooh, bit. Jiltery there. Jiltery? That's a new word. Word of the day! Jiltery! Jiltery! Yes! I meant to say jittery, but hey, <laughs> whatever. Um. Yeah, it just looks like a. I keep saying M. 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 It looks like a abandoned um, house. 
village, village, yeah, town, found the town, there you go. Word, seriously. I think I'll head back to base though, because it's getting dark and everything. Ah, oh, dear, found my ladder as well. Nom, 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 nom. Mm, all the rations. I need to fill those water bottles up. Yeah, jars. There we go. I'll boil them later. At a later date. Meals. Thing this game is, I wouldn't play this game with with music on because you were not able to hear anything. If you listen out, you can actually hear everything around you. So, if I heard a player walking, I could hide somewhere. If I heard a zombie, it could shoot it in the face. So, that's something to look out for if you're playing this. Um, looks like they're still doing the moat. <laughs> trying to find the goddamn ladder. Where is it? Floating bushes floating. Looks like there's gaps in the wall, like underneath. You might get away with a spade or pickaxe or something. Spider zombie. Shut up! You'll make so much noise! Jesus. It's like they're having fun. Ah, I can't find my goddamn ladder. Oh, it's a frame. They should probably make a door or something. Seriously. <laughs> or at least I can remember the goddamn ladder. Oh, that's a lot of spikes. Oh, I thought it was a landmine then. That would not be fun. <laughs> landmines. They're so be. Oh, jeez. They've certainly gone to town with these spikes. <sighs> Right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna steal these wood frames. Try and get over the goddamn wall. Uh, if I put that here, and then do that, and then pull the arm, then I should be over. Yeah, there you go. That was easy. <laughs> oh, I hope people don't see this video come on and go, Oh, I know how to get up your wall now. Then again, there's a heap of spikes out there, so... Oh, what's the text on like? Ah, well. No luck finding any deer. Deer. Oops. Deer. Sad face. Sad face. I did find some eggs, however, and I do have some water, so murky water. Uh, I could wear blah 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 blah, blah, blah coal. There it is. Uh, in the murky water first. Five minutes. It's best to put in your ingredients and then put in the coal. Is that way you can uh, don't forget to kill blah, blah, click cook either because. Um, Sometimes you forget and it burns out the coal and then it's not done anything. <laughs> but yeah, it's best to put in your ingredients and then put the coal in. At least then you know what the timers are and everything. It's also a good idea to put in a bit more coal than the timer because the timer runs out. So it can sometimes run out slower than the uh, coal timer for some reason. Meaning you've lost some water. And also try not to crash or log out or anything during cooking because you will actually lose your stuff that's in the in the furnace uh, not furnace sorry minecraft reference in the uh, campfire yep yeah uh, yes i will be back in a bit yes
And I am back. Well, I uh, found my deer. Yeah. Most unlikely place ever. Right inside the face. Just casually standing here drinking water. Hmm. And apparently, it's unkillable. Who knew? Oh, there we go. Alright. Oh, what a depressing sound that was. Can I not loot it? There we go. Oh, yeah. yeah. Come on. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Just would not let me loot it. Yay, venison. Yay. Just to show you where exactly that was, it's, um, yeah, my house is just behind that one there, so, right there. There was actually a spider zombie there as well, which I shot in the head. Uh, only reason I'm using my crossbow right now is because I have a bolt, a few bolt, have a bolt, yeah, wow. I have a few bolts to, uh, sp to, uh, spare, so, I thought I'd just get rid of them and use the actual proper ammo and something useful. Uh, like the crossbow is like the pistol, one shot in the head and they're dead. Um, shotgun is not like that. Uh, you have to shoot things twice in the head because logic. You'd think a shotgun would be more lethal than a bit, bit pistol. A pistol, almost a pistol. A pistol, but apparently it isn't. But yes, thank you for watching. Like and favorite if you enjoyed. Become a frog today and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!